Hi, I'm Leo, and I'm in third grade. I'm currently working on the JPL open source rover. So, you can see here. And I chose to do CS50 to um, code the rover. Now, let me show you one of the projects I did on Scratch. So, um, I will show you the code to this program. So the code in here, this is the code for the rocket. This is when S key is pressed. This is what starts the program. I press the S key on my laptop, and that starts to set that sets the counter to zero, which is this little box in the corner. And then it also sets it sets the x coordinate to sixteen which is move this rocket to the middle. And also I have this all this code in here, which basically lets allow this rocket to go to, when I click on the left arrow, it makes a rocket go to the left. And when I click on the right arrow, it makes a rocket go to the right. So I have this code. If key left arrow is pressed, then change x coordinates by negative three. If key right arrow is pressed, then change x coordinates by positive three. And also have sex, set x to x coordinates. If touching star, then place sound lose until done. Change counter by one. If touching star two, then place sound lose until done. Change counter by one. If touching dot, then play sound lose until done. Change counter by one. So, with this code right here, basically telling me that if I touch one of these objects right here, this star here or this star that's hiding behind this rocket, like this one here, and this little dog that they call a dot, if I touch any of those, it automatically sets um, adds one to this counter. Let's see some code for the other um, scripts, sprites. So this is a code for star, star two, and dot. They're basically all similar code. They have when S key is pressed, which is what starts a game, I told you, and repeat until counter equals three or key space pressed. That means that when, when I touch a object three times, that, um, that makes all the objects freeze, including this rocket. And what, uh, or I can press this, the key space, which I act, which I call, um, act as, which it acts like a um, pause button, which pauses the whole game. And, and also I put, if touching edge, then go to X 72, Y 137, change Y by negative one. So, this is basically when I have a, like, when the start reaches the end here, it can circle back up and it keeps decreasing in the y axis. And it's the same thing as star and dot. This is CS50. I'm Leo. Bye.